Okay. Oh, Betsy. Oh, Betsy. Can't forget box toppers. I'll do the uh, then and nows later. I need to write down which ones are damaged. Yeah, how are you? Mm -hmm. Country fried chicken kicking in. Oh. Just in time for 10 boxes of oh, opening my. day. Chad, have you ever opened 10 boxes of opening day country with a Pepsi? After a country fried chicken meal? After a large meal that puts you to sleep? With extra gluten? With extra gluten? <laughs> Jen, have you ever had a large meal that just put you straight to sleep? With extra gluten? <laughs> All right. Can I get extra gluten with that? I'm going to bet on a few more of Chad's auctions here before I start. I wonder if anyone ever goes in and requests extra gluten. Make sure. Or she just wants some batter. <laughs> I lost Cedric. <laughs> Here, some, some batter and some gravy. Go to town. <laughs> I said a large meal that's put you to sleep. Chad took it some sort of insult. He was offended by the large meal comment. I'm going to win Danny Jansen. I will. All right, I got to pull up the checklist here at the same time. I'm not sure on some of these short print guys if they got autos. I know Kofex does. Of course, it's one in a billion cases, but he still has a chance. Kofex is in Gypsy Queen? Yeah, is Hammer and Hank in Gypsy Queen? Besides the short print? Fran Mel Reyes has autos. No Hank auto that I see. Sandy's in it. Max Muncy's in it. Get it, Muncy, Muncy. <laughs> I didn't get it. Hi, right, Manuel. <laughs> I didn't get anything down in. Is there a lot of diseases down in Springfield? Is that a shot at the double-A Cardinals? Springfield, Missouri, is that where the double-A Cardinals are? So there's a lot of Springfields. Haley kept wanting to know if that was the Springfield from the Simpsons, but I told her it was the one in Illinois. Lewis I just got? You can have him, James. Oh, nice. Look at that full sig. I didn't see your post, but I, I'll sell them to anyone. So you got them. That's a really nice one. That is. 
Oh, great, man. Well, I have some of your cards still here. So we'll get another one together. Oh, crap. I just spilled Pepsi all over the keyboard. Did you? Yeah. What'd you get for drinking that stuff? Well, I did that. Remember I did that with my laptop once. It ruined the computer. Of course, like, not worried about the keyboard. Do you have another one? Clean up, crew. Holy cow. That's Pepsi. James, you know I don't bid on Luis just because I know you want him bad enough. You'd probably beat me anyways on him. Oh my god, cleaning the keyboard. My whole screen went nuts on him. I bet. Might as well finish cleaning it before I work out the screen. Are you using bouncy? Clicker, clicker, upper? This is our first ever pack Pepsi accident on the. Yeah. Um, when when you were broadcasting. Yeah, I don't remember knocking a Pepsi over before. Well, moments in arcade break history. <laughs> <laughs> my screen is in like, and my screen looks like seven to ten cats walked across the computer. That's a possibility in this household. Alright. That's as clean as it's gonna be. It'd be funny as if I spilled it again right now. I think I'm fully capable of that too. I might put it over here out of my range. Out of harm's way. Alright. Let me try to figure out why my screen is all screwed up like this. Okay, how did I get this full screen page up? Well, I don't know, you're mashing all the keys at once. Oh, I had to clean it. How do you get rid of this crap? Is that escape? I need IT help. There you go. Oh, Jason got it. Nice. IT granted. Tell me so, Garn. Okay. I got crickets to that. I said, call me Sogard. At least you should have hired me. That's an that. inside joke. I'm the only one that gets Yeah, I know. That's what I was going for. Can't crickets me up. You lost your sheet? No, I know where it's at. I'm just not going to say it. It's not my most organized night. No. <laughs> How much, hold on a second. How much if, you, if I can bring the sheet down in the next three minutes? Is it upstairs? Okay. Jason thinks he's being smart. Okay. Odd number. We do... Let me open this case first. I can't show you the top of the case because 
the case is like 40 feet high. All right, we got left and right side. Odd numbers left, even numbers right. I knew it. You found it? I knew I could come up with it. Was it in the bathroom? <laughs> Surprisingly, that was my guess, but it wasn't. It was in route to the bathroom. Uh oh. All right, I did left, so it's or odd, so it's left side. Ten boxes. I should be done in probably 25 to 30 minutes. Yeah. I'm going to dig deep and go range for a and monkeys and I still have no time. <laughs> hey, I bid on Danny Jansen. Did I win him? I like the kid. That's my catcher. That's an 18 Bowman Chrome case. 18 Bowman Chrome. Okay. Everybody, I'm going to endure 10 boxes here for fun. Arizona is, let's see. Manuel's got a lot of teams. I'll read them all. Manuel, you got Arizona and Colorado, Miami, New York, Yankees, Philadelphia, San Francisco Giants, if that sounds right. Michael Nelson, you got the Braves. Nate Ford has his Cubs. Brian's got his White Sox. Adam's got the Reds. David's got Indians. All those guys collect their those teams. Um, Doug King has the Tigers. Jeff Anisek has Houston. Nick Thomas has the Royals. Colby has the Angels. David has the Brewers. Will has the Twins. Dell has the Mets. <clears throat> Yohe has the Athletics. Nick Thomas has the Pirates. James Fox has the Padres. Colby has the Mariners. Tom has the um, Cardinals. Yohei has the Rays. Jeff has the Rangers. Uh, Dave Shim has the Nationals. And James took the Dodgers. I had two teams left over that I took. Baltimore and Toronto. If anybody wants those, speak now. Or forever hold their peace or I'll take them. I don't mind having them, but if somebody wants them, they can have them. Baltimore and Toronto. So here we go. Ten boxes of opening day. I like the looks of the cards. But it is definitely... A collector's product and not a gambler's product because there's not that many huge hits but the cards are really nice I didn't win Danny Jansen I'm gonna bet on a couple of Chad's items real quick in the next and then I'll open for Chad's got gypsy queen ending Give you a free advertisement. Ooh, I better on him. Chad, you do a better job of spacing out your auctions. Like they end over the course of like two hours. So where opening day truly takes a long time is opening. There's a lot to open. Uh, Toronto is uh, $10 if you want it, Chad. I don't know if Jansen's in it, though. 
you might want to check and make sure he has a rookie card in it if that's what you're going for. He might. I really can't remember. Well, I haven't opened any yet, Jeff. You haven't missed anything. I mean, I've opened some, but I haven't gone through it. This is the first box. I dumped my pop on the keyboard. It took me 10 minutes to clean it up. I didn't think he was in it. For some reason, as soon as you said that, I'm like, I don't think Jansen's in it. Baltimore has Cedric Mullins. And an auto chance of Cedric Mullins. go through a box I might open them two at a time after this just so I fly through them so they got like one insert per pack I'll go over the better inserts and definitely the parallels here's the thing about this product guys is I could easily miss a variation because it's it's really hard to tell. I missed my variations you know, when I sorted. My wife found one. So definitely go through your base and make sure you don't have a variation. Because it's going to be really hard for me to say, oh, that's a variation. Joe Morgan. Insert. They got these mascot cards that are pretty popular, actually. Babe Ruth for the Yankees. You say? We'll probably... I think you're going to get about 10 of every base card. Maybe 8 to 10. I can't remember what it was for me. I'll keep him separate, though. Zacuna. Pedro Martinez insert. D backs mascot. 150 years with Ichiro. The inserts are really nice. It's a nice design. Refresh in my screen. It looked like it was going a little weird. Let's keep going. Let's see. I'm going to make a stack for the sleeved inserts, for the opening day inserts. If you have a variation and you're going to keep watching with me, you should look at the picture. That way, if you see me pull it, you can tell me, go back, that was my variation. Of 
Goldie's in a Cardinal uniform in this. That's kind of cool. First parallel card is Albert Pujols. Angels, yeah. David, I am just starting the first box. Not very far into it. Jim Palmer, insert. For the Padres, I like this Tony Gwynn card with the statue. Thought that was a neat card. Sandy Koufax. Kyle Tucker, rookie. Urias is horizontal. I don't think there's that many horizontal cards, so that would be easy to see. Acuna insert. Ernie Banks. Here's Ryan O'Hearn. Lou Gehrig. Oh, excuse me. That's Freebird right there, or Fred Bird right there. I call him Freebird. <coughs> Excuse me. There's Moki. Roberto Clemente, 150 years. Now, I think I'd recognize a Trout variation just because I've seen his card so many times. Reggie Jackson. Mr. Red Mascot. Second blue parallel, bright blue parallel, Gregory Polanco for the Pirates. Oh, you got a Hosmer Dirt card? That's kind of neat. I did hit a dirt card of Chris Davis in my uh, first case. Lindor, 150 years. Blue Jays mascot card, that's all mine. <coughs> Excuse me. Gary Carter, 150 years. Nolan Ryan in the Astros uniform. Paws mascot for the Tigers. Blue parallel Ozzy Albies for Atlanta. Ty Cobb, 150 years of fun. David Ortiz, mascot for Cleveland, slider, Ozzie Smith, and that's all she wrote for box one. You get about, you get about a set in each box. I think it's just short of a set.
Hank for 15. I don't think Hank had anything but short prints. That's probably why he went a little cheaper than normal. You got Fran Mail Reyes? He's my right fielder. I'm just hoping Renfro doesn't steal too much of his time. I will do a recap at the end, of course, with anything odd that I find and the parallels. Even Hunter Dozier? What about Hunter Stalling? Did Bubba make AAA for the Royals yet? He's going to hit it big time at some point. It's just going to take like 10 years. Box 2. You got a Bernie Brewer mascot. Joe Morgan. A tiny card. Babe Ruth. Ted Williams. Mike Trout. Oh, he hit 380 this spring. I wonder what a 9510 of his uh, Chrome Auto goes for. Mascot of the A's. Sure, first blue parallel in this box is Sean Mania. For the Oakland Athletics. Tom Seaver, 150 years of fun. Hundred and fifty years of fun, Jackie Robinson. Frank Thomas. It's like a 50 card set, this 150, 150 yards of fun, and it's basically, basically like the 50 best players of all time are pretty close. TC Bear. Hank Aaron. <clears throat> we call him J-Lo now. Chad, he's got a new name. Roberto Clemente, I can say that name. Screech, mascot for the Nationals. Gary Carter, 150 years of fun. Years of fun. Second parallel in this box is Luis Severino. They, if you do opening day every year, they made the Blues a little bit tougher this year. There are three per box. Reggie Jackson, 150 years. Team celebrations with Trout on it. 
Wally the Green Monster mascot. Blue parallel of Carlos Correa for the Astros. And Nolan Ryan, 150 years of fun. He's in his Astro uniform there. Mr. Met mascot. Francisco Lindor insert there for David. And a Luis rookie. A little bit left. Clark, the mascot for the Cubs. Derek Jeter, 150 years of fun. Ty Cobb. Round two, auto for you say. David Ortiz insert. Ozzy Smith. Rangers mascot, Lou Gehrig, opening day, I'm two boxes deep, nothing special so far, other than some parallels, some nice inserts, and a whole lot of base. Box three. I didn't have Soto in my watching. Did Juan Soto in Chad? You're not halfway through if Soto hasn't ended. You got all the big names still. Soto, Acuna, Otani, Trout. You worry more than me. What's Soto at? <laughs> yeah, but one of those breaks, one of those breaks was Donruss Baseball, remember? I feel like I should just spend 45 minutes opening the packs and have just like a huge conglomerate of cards here. You guys can go like watch an episode of Seinfeld and come back and I'll have all the packs open.
Soto's 39. That'll go up. He's probably got the most watchers of anybody, doesn't he? Actually, it's usually Trout. All right. <coughs> Here we go. Box three. Got pause for the Tigers. We got Ty Cobb. Opening day. David Ortiz. Jim Palmer insert. I got Slugger. He's the mascot for the Royals. All the kids love him in Kansas City. Tom Seaver, 150 years of fun. San Diego, Swinging Friar mascot. Jackie Robinson, opening day, Derek Jeter, Pirates mascot, Frank Thomas, Kyle Tucker, rookie. Hank Aaron. Uh, Blue Jays mascot. Mike Fultonwitz, blue, Atlanta. Gary Carter, insert. Nolan Ryan. Sandy Kopex. Ronald Acuna insert card for Atlanta. Mariner Moose. Ernie Banks, Ted Williams, fishing, Baltimore Orioles mascot, and a blue parallel for the Phillies, Jake Arrieta. You know, I noticed that Altuve had, uh, he was in like every single tough autograph set. So it doesn't surprise me that he's going a little better. Mike Trout. Nothing rare yet, Yohei. Nothing real special so far. Just about what you'd expect. A lot of nice inserts. Pedro. And the blue parallels. Ichiro. Billy the Marlin. Blue parallel Zach Godley.
Cal Ripken. Yeah, we had a lot of people going for the Mariners. Which I can understand. You get about 10 rookies of him. 9 or 10, probably. I got 3 and 3 boxes so far. Box 4. Uh, I might do one more. Ask me after the break. And I'll tell you. I'll probably do the second half for sure. Yeah, it's a 20 box case. Keep getting out bed, Chad. Yep, it's a 20 box case. Yo, hey, I'm doing 10 of them right now. Well, with Gypsy Queen, you get a lot more autos. So your chances of getting some of the auto names are much better than Heritage. But they, they do sell cheaper. They're beautiful cards, though. I like opening it because the base cards are so nice and they make nice team sets. You get a lot more parallels in Gypsy Queen than you do Heritage also. Heritage, you don't get that many parallels. Heritage is so tough. It is. Chris is getting a case of Gypsy Queen this week. Is he? Yeah. That's his jam. It is his jam. He loves that stuff. About 50 Six Y? Oh God! I just think that if you have a high minimum, which I did on all mine, that they're not going to break it out unless it's really perfect. Uh, I think you're probably better off just breaking it out and sending it in if it's. But if you don't want to lose that grade, I understand. Well, these are all gem plus. Every yeah. single one is gem plus or quad nine fives. Yeah, that's what I sent in. Ten of them, and I got two tens. You had nine subs on them. I looked on them. Really? Mm -hmm. I thought for sure they were all uh, high grades. But with PSA, you know, with nine centering, it's not going to matter, really. Nine centering on BGS. That would be my one exception where I would send it yeah. with nine centering. Like, I was considering sending that orange Gorman because it's got nine center. Yeah. I would think that they that would still be a 10, but, I mean, if you look at those cards, 
I think that, I think if I broke oh, it I out and set it in, it would be a ten. Got jammed, no question. Yeah. But I didn't need a bunch of them, but I at least needed a few more. There's a tough card. Uh, <clears throat> our first tougher insert is a rally time of Wilson Contreras for the Cubs. These are about four per case, I think. Maybe less than that. First tough insert, rally time, Wilson Contreras for the Cubbies. I might try it again. It's just, I think they're just tougher because they can't see the card as well when it's in the case. I think that's part of the problem. Derek Rodriguez, blue parallel. He's my player. Added a couple miles an hour to his fastball. I like that. Ted Williams. Mike Trout. There's no Jack Flaherty. I don't think he's got... Did you get Yohei's cards? Yeah, yeah I got them. Yeah, he got yours. Mascot for the A's. I did 10 crossovers and I got went 2 for 10. Or maybe I did 9. Which I'll probably still break even on the plus up. But I was disappointed. I thought I'd get a few more than that. The ones I was really disappointed were the vintage ones. I think I should have just broke those out and sent them in. 150 years of uh, Tom Seaver. I like that Ernie Banks one, SGC. I feel like just breaking that out and sending it in. Man, someone's got graded draft singles selling on eBay tonight. They're going huge. Jackie Robinson, yeah, it's good timing with the season starting. 150 for baseball. Jeez, that's a lot higher than before. What time? Babe Ruth. Pedro Martinez. Mascot for the D backs. Xander Bogarts. Blue Parallel. Lumber King. Xander. He's a Lumber King. He is a Lumber King. Ichiro. Sandy Koufax. Blooper mascot. Kyle Tucker rookie. Ronald Acuna insert. He's a Lumber King. Yeah. You shut up. No, I won't. I wish you could say that about him. Yeah, I'd take Acuna. Ernie Banks, 150 years. He's not a Lumber King. Slider mascot. My last year, Chris Bryant. Ozzie Smith. You trade him out around midseason. <laughs> you going to trade him? Lou Gehrig. I doubt if you'd be trading. I hope you're not be trading. Fred Bird. He's the mascot for the St. Louis Cardinals. I like to call him Free Bird. Corey Dickerson. Blue parallel for the Pirates. Roberto Clemente, 150. I wish I could tell if I hit a variation because it would be a cool card to hit, but it's impossible unless it's a weird design and catches my eye. Tony Gwynn statue. Or a weird pitcher, I guess is what I meant. Reggie Jackson. Mr. Red. I would catch a Mookie or a Trout variation for sure, because I know what those cards look like. Lindor, 150 years. You told me to shut up. It's so mean and rude. <laughs> I did not. <laughs> Joe Morgan. Orbit, he's a mascot for the Astros. Over here getting fired up for baseball to start, and you're jamming me up. Raining on my fantasy baseball career. Cal, Cal Ripken, autographing a jersey for a kid. 
Dinger, the mascot for the Rockies. Jim Palmer. And that is it for that box. I am four dot boxes deep. We got ourselves a rally time of Wilson Contreras in that box. I'll be getting up in time for work by the time we get done. <laughs> I'm four boxes deep. I'd do like a four caser of this on a dare. I dare you to do four caser. <coughs> player. Should not have your wife sorted. <laughs> well, that would All be card good. Ship. <laughs> Fred Bird. <laughs> eBay shipping rules. Tom wants you to check out all his Fred Birds to see if he should be grade them. I think they're going to 10, Tom. That sounds like something I would actually do. That would be telling Jason. Nobody else is going to have these graded. I can see him moving. Pop one. Well, it'd be more than pop one. Because I would send in five. Yeah. It'd be a pop zero. If you're grading well. Four case player break. Tops opening day. Yeah, I'm going to slip that one out, big dog. Can I space it over a course of eight weeks? I'll be hitting the bench. Imagine people, the shipping would be alone. Every single player would be a flat rate. My legs stretched out. My nice, cold, non alcoholic beverage. If, you're, if, you're, if you need a uh, 80 count lot of the base guard, you know that would be the perfect auction. Time to open four cases of it himself, he said. I opened one case, but I didn't sort it. How did you avoid carpal tunnel? Uh, it's not too bad. I should open my heritage packs. All packs should open my heritage packs. Well, I didn't win Soto. Did you try? Yeah, I did bid on Soto. Oops, I'm bid on Lou Gehrig. There's the next guy I'm bidding on right there. Oh, I'm going to go bid on that guy. I thought maybe I could steal him for about six or seven bucks, though. He's already at nine. Why don't you step your bed game up a little bit and help the guy out? I'm bid not a few. I'm talking about this Mr. Particular guy here. Well, yeah. that is a Beastie Boys song. <laughs> Beastie after. Boys. Thought I had a thick card there for a second. You had a relic in this. Some dirt. The only one I hit. He hoards them, yo, uh, yo hey. He hoards. Is on sold. He doesn't like to sell cards. I think it would take. I think it takes longer to open this than it does to sort. To be honest, but it does. It's not that many cards, but to open it takes a while. All right, box number five. We're gonna hit an autograph from this box, so stick around. I can sense it. Roberto Clemente. Yeah, sorry, I won't be sticking around. It's going to happen. Go Screech, the mascot. Bridgie Jackson. One of those prison football boxes are probably hot. Gold. Francisco Lindor. I don't think the retails are worth all, all that much. Aren't there. Bernie Brewer. Joe Morgan. What? <coughs> Walker.
Wally the Green Monster mascot. Babe Ruth. Philly Fanatic. You know, I don't think I've sold my bone PSA 10. Should I raise it? Went for 148 for a high sub BGS. Will you check and see what I have the 10 listed for? Lindor Blue. Pedro Martinez. Ichiro. Billy the Marlin mask guide. Well, I think with the base card you in Gypsy Queen, you get a whole lot of them. Good job, James. Now just make sure he hits you an auto. Cal Ripken. I think that's a pretty solid deal, actually, for him. There's one listed for 100 that didn't sell yet. PSA 10? Yeah. Yours is listed for 130. How in the world did that 9.5 go for that much then? It's crazy. Is that just the case of a couple people? Uh, was it PWCC? No. Uh, Gunther. Hmm. Nolan Ryan, 150 years of fun. Ty Cobb. Raymond, the mask guy. Hi, Jim. Uh, it was an Alec Bohm 9510 Chrome Auto sold for a little higher than normal. That's what Jason was talking about. David Ortiz, 150 years. It was Gem Plus sold for 148 bucks. Ozzy Smith. Rangers Captain. I'm running out of cards to hit my auto. I hit a blue parallel. The best Cardinal, one of the best Cardinals of all time. Yadi Molina. That is true. Lou Gehrig, 150 years. Nice hit there for the Cardinal spot. Clark, the mascot for the Cubs. Derek Jeter, 150 years. Frank Thomas, 150 years. TC Bear, he's the mascot for the Mighty Twins. In a blue parallel of Carlos Rodon. Pitcher for the White Sox. Did I get shut out, Dave? I know Jacob hit a big car because he was rubbing my nose in it. Uh, Hank Aaron, 150 years. Jacob is so lucky. What? He always hits cards. Yeah, in Chimps Break, he hit a Luca Auto. Cornerstone Auto. Oh, cool. Gary Carter. He drew the Mavericks? Yeah, and he was like, look at what I hit and you didn't, Ryan. That type of thing. So rude. I guess you're trying to deserve it with the amount of trollers you see in this direction. I never troll them. I had an auto that you want. So that means I had an auto of the Oklahoma City Thunder. Either that or a Sean Kemp. Probably hit that Diallo rookie. And Brent Berry in the Sonics uniform. <laughs> oh That's not what I was looking for, Shim.
Did you tell Jacob that he owes us all for stealing the break? Ooh, I got 44 seconds till my player ends. What teams did I have, Shim? Did I have the Thunder and another team? You're supposed to hit the Luka in the second half, Dave. Thunder in the Pacers. Dave, go live in 30 minutes and open the other half. Wasn't the Tropicals uh, a good team with Will Ferrell? Okay. <coughs> Ernie Banks. Mr. Met. Ted Williams. Mike Trout, Ichiro, Cal Ripken, Mookie's going for more than Ronald right now, Chad. Dinger, the mascot. Jim Palmer. Show me an autograph. I got one auto in my 20 box case. I was hoping for two. I got one. It wasn't that great. I think the mascot autos are the coolest. Sandy Kofax.
blooper mascot for the Braves. Edwin Diaz, closer for the Mets, blue parallel. Goldschmidt in the Cardinals uniform has been strong. That's pretty high, 47. Does Goldie have an auto in this? It wouldn't surprise me at all if he went for like 20 to 30 just because the base card is nice. Cardinals uniform, a lot of people want that early on. But 47 is actually pretty strong. Acuna, 150 years. Ty Cobb. David Ortiz. Slider, the mascot. Jonathan VR, blue parallel for the Orioles. Those first Cardinal Goldschmidt autos will be really popular. Ozzie Smith. Pedro. Lou Gehrig. Fred Bird. Roberto Clemente. Reggie Jackson. And the second one of these parallels rally time is for Atlanta, Ozzy Albies. Mr. Red. Lindor insert. Yeah, the Chromes will be very popular. I agree. Mascot for the Diamondbacks. Joe Morgan. Orbit. Blue parallel for the Diamondbacks, David Peralta. Babe Ruth, 150 yards of fun. And a Tony Gwynn statue card. Four boxes left. Six done. Nothing crazy special yet. No jerseys, no autos. Two of the special inserts. I wish Mookie would start signing. What's that kid's problem? I guess.
<laughs> that might be it. I'm waiting for that 10 card subset in a Topps product that has Mookie's best 10 bowling tournaments. See, if I was Topps, I would sign Mookie up for a deal. I would have like a 20 card set of different tournaments that Mookie's played in and then have him sign 10 of each one. Mookie Chase would be on. All right, this is box seven. Ted Williams, I'm waiting for something really shiny and signature like in here. There's an auto. We got an auto. Behind the mascot is an auto. Phillies, Gene Segura. That's not too bad. That's better than the one I got. New player for the Phillies. That might be his first Phillies auto. That is Manuel's. Autograph for you, Gene Segura. First Phillies auto, I think. Kind of a neat card. That is better than the kick in the head. Oh, look at that. I got me a blue parallel Mookie Betts. That looks like a PSA 10, too. Put that right into my registry. Nice Boston. That's Oliver's. This box has been the best box so far. Mike Trout. Jean Zagura. I'm going to be drafting him come Saturday because I need the steals. I think he'll be pretty good on the Phillies, too. Tom Seaver. <coughs> Mascot for the Padres. Jackie Robinson. Derek Jeter. Pirates mascot. Screech. A blue parallel for the Angels, Jamie Barrera. Reggie Jackson insert. Francisco Lindor. Bernie the Brewer. Joe Morgan. Slugger, mascot for the Royals. Sandy Koufax. Ronald Acuna. Mariner Moose. Ernie Banks.
Jaime. Jaime Barrera. You got me. Babe Ruth. That one's easy enough. Philly Fanatic. <clears throat> Philly Fanatic. He's in his own commercials. Pedro Martinez. Uh. Ichiro Billy the Marlin Does O'Hearn have autographs in this, Chad? Do you know? Nice purple of Aaron Nola This was a nice box for the Phillies Cal Ripken. Lou Gehrig. Roberto Clemente, Jim Palmer. Whew, I'm seven boxes done. I can see the end. Base and Chrome, okay. I can see the finish line. Three boxes left. I think I'm going to cancel the 80 case player break or the 80 box player break. If I did 80 boxes of this, that would be that would be six three-row boxes to sort by team and player. That's the kind of thing that can flat out get me a divorce. That's six boxes, Chad. You got a couch for me to sleep on? That would be about 18,000 cards to sort by player and then by team. Man, Vladimir Guerrero's up to 35 bucks, Chad. <laughs> Just two cases. That's a lot to sort. She did sort one of my cases already in team sets. Player break though, you gotta sort it twice. You gotta sort it by team and then by player. It's kind of brutal. <laughs> the Vladimir. <laughs> I saw you put Expos. I was going to bid on it, but not that crazy. Yeah, you know, I lost Sandy Koufax, too.
Have you hit a mystery redemption yet this year? Or has anybody hit one? <clears throat> I haven't hit one yet this year. They're fairly tough. I don't open quite as much as I used to, but I think I'm due for one pretty soon. You hit one Inception, Tom? How much... Inception did you open, Tom, for yourself? I didn't open any Inception. I usually only open bulk products. Tony Gwynn statue? This is box eight. Box seven was our best box so far. Cal Ripken? Jim Palmer. Oh, that's not bad in one case. <laughs> I don't open as much as I used to. Sandy Koufax. I've cut down to two packs a, a, a week. Blooper for the Braves. Oh, sweet. That was a pretty good case for you then. Lou Gehrig, 150 years. Fred Bird. He's our favorite around here. Kyle Schwerber, Blue Parallel. For the Cubbies, Anna Clemente. Babe Ruth. Pedro. Mascot for the D-backs. Blue of Carlos Martinez for the Cardinals and an Ichiro insert. Reggie Jackson. Frank Thomas. Hank Aaron. Mascot for the Blue Jays. Tanaka, Blue Parallel, and Gary Carter. All those Carters will go to the Nationals, by the way, in case anybody was wondering. Nobody probably was. Tanaka. I'm bidding on Vlad. I'm bidding on Vladimir Sr. with the Expos, Chad. But if you don't include a Vladimir Jr. card in the lot that I win, I'm doing a chargeback. Mr. Red Mascot. Francisco Lindor. Nolan Ryan.
Paws, the Tigers. Ty Cup for the Tigers. Opening day. Vladimir. Dave, uh, Chad has a Vladimir Guerrero lot ending in Gypsy Queen soon. <clears throat> Joe Morgan. Go bid on it. Orbit mascot. He's guaranteeing the Vlad Auto in the lot. David Ortiz. Slider. And Ozzy Smith. If I know Chad, like I know Chad, he's already got heartburn over the Vladimir Guerrero Senior lot. For future emails saying, I thought it was Junior. The emails go like this. I won your Vladimir Guerrero Gypsy Queen Expos lot. And I thought for sure this was Vladimir Guerrero Jr. Who plays for the Blue Jays. Can you tell me which one it is? I've had emails like that before. Now, the Vlad Sr. spot should still be worth, probably. He's got an auto and a short print, right? This should be a $20 lot, at least. Well, that's a Hall of Famer, and his autos have been going a little bit better lately. I think he's been helped out by his kid. Did Shimmy bet on it? <laughs> now, Shimmy, I was joking. You can't do a chargeback to that. Sold your what? Oh, your orange bland? Yeah, he could be a future Expo Hall of Favor. That's not impossible. You sold your orange, J uh, David? Did you buy a car with it? That's a thick pack. <clears throat> thick pack. Oh, well, that's a neat card. That's somebody, the owner of this card's going to appreciate it. You watching, David? You got yourself a fancy diamond relic of Jose Ramirez. It's a pretty cool card. I lost all mine, Yohei, too. I helped him out, but I didn't win anything. I thought I was going to win a couple of them. That's a pretty neat card that David will like, I am absolutely sure.
What's uh, he at? Is that just leading to more Chad Road stress? All right, this is box nine. Roberto Clemente. Reggie Jackson. Oh, that's not as bad as I thought the way you guys were talking. Lendor insert. Bernie the Brewer. Opening day. You know what you need to start taking up, Chad, to reduce your stress level is ice skating. Jackie Robinson. I know a few instructors down there in the Kansas City metropolitan area. It can hook you up. Clark, the mascot for the Cubs, and Derek Jeter. <laughs> I heard they're cheap and affordable. 150 years, Frank Thomas. TC Bear mascot. Shinso Chu. <laughs> that might be true, Chad, but your mortgage won't later on in life come back up to you and tell you what a great father you were and appreciate all that you've done. Hank Aaron. <clears throat> Raymond, the mascot. David Ortiz. <laughs> That's not true. Ozzy Smith. Looks like Shim didn't even win, Vlad. Rangers captain, David Dahl, blue, Lou Gehrig, Mike Trout insert, Ronald Acuna insert, Ernie Banks, Mr. Matt, Corey Kluber Blue, Whit Merrifield is tearing it up in Gypsy Queen. You know, he's the royal superstar. Ted Williams. Mike Trout, Tom Seaver, Alex Gordon is, no he's just paid as a superstar, Gary Carter, What did uh, you say go for? The Mariners pitcher. Nolan Ryan insert.
I got. And I am down to one box of opening day. Just think about it. This is 10 boxes. The 80 box break would only be eight times this. Oh, he's last, isn't he? Yo, he's going to win him. All right, box 10. Four of us, including Jacob. Because Jacob ain't doing one box of opening day, let alone 20. Or 40. <laughs> What's he at, Yohei? Is he higher than Whit Merrifield? Seventy six. What do you think his auto will be worth in that? There's Jacob Ali. The tag did it. See, I don't think that's that bad of a deal. Am I the only one that thinks that's not that bad of a deal? If I mean, he's not going to be that tough of an auto. I mean, you're gambling for sure, but if he had base cards, I would be definitely all over it. And remember, though, Chad's doing, what, 24 boxes? So you're going to 48 autos. So the chances of you getting an auto is probably, I don't know how often he's going to sign. I know he only has an auto in it, but he may not be that tough of an auto is what I'm saying. Oh, it's only 10, so 20. So there's 40 autos. It's hard to tell without seeing some open. But if he's not that uncommon of an auto, then it's not that terrible of a deal. I still... I would need the base cards. Okay. Yeah, but you get it in, what, 10 weeks? I know a lot of people that used to buy Topps Online Autos that just won't buy them anymore. They just take forever to get. They don't go very well either. I would say his, his Gypsy Queen Auto could easily go for more than a Topps Online to 99. Honestly, they just those Topps Nows just don't go that great. Mascot card. This is the last box. Gary Carter.
I think 150 is probably a pretty good guess. So then it just comes down to how often you get them, you know what I mean? But you could get a parallel too, remember. He's got more than just base cards. You could get 1 to 25. No one Ryan insert? It's definitely a gamble. Pause, mascot. Mike Trout. Tom Seaver. Mascot. I can get those uh, top style autos the day beforehand and reserve them, Yohei. I can get them like the day before because I buy so much from tops online. But they don't give me the price, so I never get them. Jackie Robinson. I emailed them back and I'm like, why don't you give out a price if you're going to offer these early? And they're like, we don't get out the price till the next day. I'm like, I don't buy anything without knowing the price. Derek Jeter. Pirate Parrot. Todd Frazier, Blue Parallel. I am the top level from buying all those stupid living set items. I deserve it. I got hordes of living set cards. Frank Thomas. But they don't give me the price, so what's the point of even selling it, sending it to me? I can't buy something without knowing what the price is. It could be ungodly. Hank Aaron. Joe Morgan. It really doesn't help. Babe Ruth. Matt Chapman for Oakland, Blue Parallel. Pedro Martinez. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ichiro. Billy the Marlin. Cal Ripken, 150 years. Let's get one more tough card. Jim Palmer. Sandy Koufax. Ronald Acuna. What was the price of it? I, I, I've i never, I don't know if I've ever bought anything in my entire life without knowing the price, to be honest. I mean, I think that concept is so weird. I, I have no idea why they wouldn't want you to know the price. Mariner Moose, not something that could be really expensive. Michael Conforto for the Mets. 1300 yeah, that's expensive. 150 years of fun. Ernie Banks. I don't understand why it helps tops not to tell somebody the price. Can anybody figure out why that would be an advantage to not tell somebody the price? I don't get that. Ted Williams, 150 years. Mascot for the Orioles. And that's it. Those are 10 long boxes of opening day. Got 11 Yusei rookies. 
Uh, for the recap, I'll uh, do the blues. Again, there is probably um, there's probably a 50% chance maybe I got a, a variation in this base and missed it. So go through your base when you get it and make sure I didn't hit a variation for you, especially if you have a team that has a variation. Okay, blue parallels. Conforto, Chapman, Frazier, Kluber, Dahl, Chu, Tanaka, Carlos Martinez, Schwarber, Nola, Barrara, Mookie, Betts, Peralta, Villar, Diaz, Rodon, Molina, Lindor, Dickerson, Bogarts, Rodriguez, Godley, Jake Arrieta, Mike Fultonwitz, Carlos Correa, Luis Severino, Mania, Albies, Polanco, and Pujols. And I got four special cards. I got a rally time of Ozzy Albies. I got a rally time of Wilson Contreras. I got a Diamond Relics Dirt of Jose Ramirez. And we got one auto. I think it's Gene Segura's first Phillies auto, but I'm not sure. Segura. And that's it. And a lot of base cards. And you know what? I ship all base. So you're going to get 10 to 11 team sets of your favorite team. You get a bunch of these 150 yard years inserts. I'll sleeve those up and include them too. And everything else. That's it. I did opening day. Don't let anybody ever tell you that I didn't fulfill my promise of doing an opening day break. I'll probably do the other 10 boxes at some point when I'm feeling aggressive for ripping 360 packs. <clears throat> so, yeah, David, I'll, I'll do the other 10 boxes in this case, David. And, um,. I'll offer them to the people that had the first half first if they want another chunk of it. No, I'm not doing it right now. It's not going to be this week. My next break will be Gypsy Queen on Wednesday. All right, I'm going to go get some water. You guys have a good night.